Hello, my lovelies. Welcome back to my channel, Foodish Beauty. I hope you're all having a beautiful, beautiful holiday time. And today I have another indulgent Christmas bake for you guys. And this time we have brownies. These brownies are so chocolatey. They are crispy on the outside and squidgy on the inside. So decadent and delicious. Yet I've made it gluten-free, free also of refined sugar and just that little bit less guilty to enjoy this Christmas season. So without further delay, let's start baking. First, into a glass bowl, we're going to break in 80 grams each of milk and plain chocolate. Followed by 80 grams of unsalted butter. And also a teaspoon of espresso powder to enhance the chocolatiness. Place the bowl in the microwave on the low heat for around two minutes until everything is melted. It might look a little strange at this moment, but just give it a stir and everything is going to look silky and smooth. Now on to prepping for the rest of the ingredients for our brownie. We need 158 grams of gluten-free self-raising white flour blend. I am also chopping up 100 grams of white chocolate to set aside as our filling in the brownie and they will give a white lovely speck like snow and a beautiful vanillary flavour. Also, we will be needing three large eggs, and 250 grams of raw coconut palm sugar. Add to that a teaspoon or so of vanilla extract, The addition of ground ginger and cinnamon will also make this brownie extra Christmassy. Now all our elements are ready, so all we need to do is combine the chocolate mixture with the egg mixture. And sieving in our dry ingredients, which is the gluten-free flour. After a good stir, we're going to add in some fresh raspberries and some of our chopped white chocolate. Set aside a few of those raspberries and chocolate to add on top later as well. And then we're just going to pour this all into a 20 centimeter square tin. And here are our raspberries and white chocolates being added on top. And we're going to bake this at 180 Celsius for 30 minutes or so until the surface has cracked and a skewer test comes out really runny and gooey. And then we're going to set it aside to cool on our cooling rack so the centre can develop into a gooey, squidgy one. Now because I wasn't patient enough, I shoved the whole thing in the fridge for a few hours and then it was ready to be cut into little slices and decorated. For decorating, we're just going to melt some white chocolate and drizzle that diagonally across each and every one of our squares. With the help of some sugary silver baubles, some white milk and plain chocolate stars and finally some 
edible glitter we're going to make these chocolate brownies even more Christmassy and festive and here they are in their chocolatey gingerbready and sparkly glory I hope you really make these and love them this Christmas the decoration is optional but they would definitely bring a touch of glamour to what is already a perfect brownie for this time of the year. So these are my glamorous Christmas brownies. As per usual all the ingredients and additional information will be listed below in my description box. I hope you really enjoyed watching this video. If you have then don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more. I hope you all will have a very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. All the best to you guys and I'll see you next time. Take care. Bye.